key biodiversity areas is this fantastic a prioritization tool that enables us to understand out of the whole world what are the most important places to conserve nature and because resources are very scarce for protecting nature we want to make sure that we're putting our resources in the most important places so the KBA partnership has created all of this process to understand out of the planet what are the key places where we need to focus our attention to protect them and to conserve them and better manage them the benefit of KBAs over other priority setting methods is that it allows you to identify specific sites where you can work on the ground um, that are manageable sites where you can work with governments or local communities to protect the species that trigger those sites. KBAs are identified using a set of quantitative criteria and they focus on uh, different aspects of nature that make a site globally important, either because they hold concentrations of particular species that are threatened or restricted in their distribution, or ecosystems that are very rare, or in some cases these sites hold globally important populations of species that are migratory or aggregate in particular concentrations during the breeding season, for example. The data comes from experts based all around the world who are on the ground and are able to see what's happening. They're able to provide that data to us in quite efficient and real time, which allows us to provide a database that is up to date and reliable. The subscriptions that you pay for IVAT help us make sure that the information that we're providing to companies and governments as the users are the most up-to-date and also the best integration of the different layers of information so you can have a better assessment tool.